Welcome to our FB page na Free Reviewers Managed by Lunalin. Now sa video ito, dito na tayo sa last 3. At ang video ito, i-upload din natin sa ating YouTube channel na Solving Math with Lunalin. And by the way, ito rin yung iba pang mga FB groups na lagi nating tinatambayan. Now dito na tayo sa ika-79. If a die is rolled, what is the probability of getting a number divisible by 2? Now remember, yung die meron yan siyang uh, 6 na face. So, yung 6 na yan, we have 1, 2, 3. Yung hindi natin nakita, tatlo din yan. So, yung mga numbers dyan, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Ang divisible of 2... May tatlong numbers na mga even numbers. We have 2, 4, 6. Tatlong divisible ng 2. Yung denominator, ilagay natin yung total. So, yung mga total faces sa die. 3 over 6, hanapan natin ang greatest common factor which is 3. So, 3 divided by 3 and that is 1. 6 divided by 3 and this is 2. So, ito na yung sagot. 1 half. Next, the ratio of a number, we have red, green, and blue. Red, green, and blue balls in a box is 2 is to 5 is to 6. Ang tanong how many green marbles are there if there are 52 marbles in all? So, yan yung total. Now, for more examples about ratio, meron na, na din tayong na-upload regarding sa ratio recently lang. So, for more examples about ratio, panoorin ito sa ating YouTube channel at isearch lang itong ratio. Tapos, idugtong lang yung lunalin para mas madaling ma-sort out yung dati na nating na-upload regarding sa mga ratio na yan. Maraming paraan sa pag-solve nito. So, kayo na mamili kung saan kayo hiyang. Pwede yung i-add lang itong 2 at saka si 5 at si 6 and this is 13. Yung total na yan ay i-divide natin dito sa 52 na nandito. 52 divided by 13 and this is equal to 4. Yung 4 na yan, yan yung i-multiply natin. Anong tanong dito? How many green marbles? Green marbles. So, ito lang ang i-multiply natin, yung 5 at saka si 4. 5 times 4 equals 20. So, ito na yung sagot, 20. Isa pang paraan. Isa pang paraan. So, meron tayong common number or sabi natin, let n para sa common number na i-multiply natin sa mga ratio na ito. Tapos, ang total dito ay 52. So, mga like terms yan siya, i-add natin yan, and this will give us 13. So, 13n. Now, para makuha natin yung common number na yan, since 13 ay pang multiply sa n, pang divide na ngayon yan sa 52. Or, nag-divide na ng 13 to both sides para makancel yan siya, n na lang ang natira. Now, n equals 52 divided by 13, and this is 4. Ang tanong ay yung green marbles. So, we have 5n, ang 5, ang n, ang value ni n ay 4, so 5 times 4 equals 20. Next, a building 25 meters tall cast a shadow of 10 meters long. How long is the shadow of a 5-foot girl standing beside the building? So, kung ang height nito ay 25, tapos yung shadow ay 10, while yung isa ay 5 yung height, so therefore, ang shadow dito ay 25 divided by 5, that is 5. So, therefore, itong 10 divided by 5, pareho lang din, divided by 5, and that is 2. So, yan na yung sagot. 2. Isa pang paraan. Ratio and proportion lang naman ito. So, we have 25 is to 10 equals yung 5 is to let x para sa hinahanap natin. 
Now, since ratio ito, itong gagawin natin, this is 10 times 5 and that is 50. 50, itong 50 na to, yung 25 na yan, yan yung pang-divide natin sa 50. So, 50 divided by 21, uh, 25 and this is 2. So, yan na yung value ni x. Yan na yung sagot. Isa pang paraan. 25 over 10 equals yung 5, pareho silang standing, over let x para sa hinahanap natin. Cross multiplication, this is 25x. 5 times 10 and that is 50. Para makuha natin yung x, since si 25 ay pang multiply, dyan pang divide dito sa 50. Ganun pa rin. 50 divided by 25 and that is 2. So, ang sagot dito ay 2 feet. Thank you for watching and all I hope mayroon kayong naintindihan sa video ito. Thank you and God bless.